Kind of have bad news. Don't stop looking in my eyes. This street always smells like have a facial appointment today which is very much needed and then i need to stop by the post office to pick up a couple stamps i'm gonna be out and about today and i should be heading out oh, i need coffee I'm back home now from the facial. As you can see, did a lot of extractions. I had a couple, a couple little guys. I also ended up stopping by this bookstore on my way home. And I picked up a little coffee table book. This is what it looks like. And on the inside, there's just a bunch of sketches. But if you look in here, you're gonna recognize some, some familiar names. Like right here, it says Jake Gyllenhaal on Canal. Oh, there's Jessica, Jessica Jung. It says K-pop singer. A woman curling her eyelashes on the E-train. Lunch is served. I'm about to head out to go get lunch with Frisia. We're gonna get Raku, which is kind of perfect because it's been raining all day. I feel like a warm bowl of noodles is just gonna be so comforting. I actually don't have an umbrella, so I pulled out a hoodie. I hope it's enough. This is today's outfit. We're just full on comfort mode here. Take two. <laughs> Thank you. <gasps> Wait, I didn't even recognize the logo on top. For all your future coffee shots. Wait, thank you. That's so nice. Uh, how'd you know I didn't have a coffee thing yet? I made sure I uh, didn't use work okay, so I texted the cheese. Uh -huh. Kind of have bad news. I found mold in my dishwasher and and this is a new building, so the dishwasher is new, it's never been used. So I found it very strange that there was mold in there. Uh, and so I reached out to my super and uh, they were basically saying when they installed it, they probably ran it just to make sure that it's working. And then they probably didn't let it properly dry and they just closed it. And so three months passed before anyone moves in and you know, that's how mold grows. Now I need vinegar and baking soda and maybe a toothbrush so i guess that's what i'm going to be doing this morning and i'm going to treat myself to an iced coffee <laughs> back home and that was kind of a fail because I couldn't find just distilled vinegar anywhere. I went to three different places and no one had vinegar which means I can't really run it the way I want to yet. So I think I'm just gonna order it online with some like dishwasher pods. I guess this is a project for another day. <laughs> sorry for, sorry for bringing you guys along. <laughs>
to get some bon bees. You want your own? Yeah. And a little IKEA double date. <laughs> the beige one. And So it's a new day. I thought I would show you guys what I got at Ikea. I didn't get too much, but I did get this. Here, let's do a little tour. So I got this. Oh my gosh, don't fall. Ah! I saved it. So I got this plant. It's fake. I don't have like much of a green thumb, so I don't know. It's something that I obviously, if I took the time to learn and well, if I just took the time to take care of my plants, I'm sure it'd be a different story, but I never really got around to it or I never really got into it. Um, so yeah, that's that. <sighs> this little duo here. This is soy sauce and this is rice vinegar. Those are just two ingredients that I tend to reach for a little bit more, especially when I make salad dressing. I just like having that out. Everything else I've kind of stored away. And then I got three little Tupperware containers. And then I got this clear bowl. I think I'll have a lot of uses for it, whether it's for salad, bibimbap, whatever. All right, all good. I think that's it. Is that really all I got? Anyways. So unfortunately this week, I don't have too many apartment updates. I mean, the only new thing that I got is probably this dining table and it's just like a standard round glass dining table. I'm still waiting on my big ticket items like my couch, my TV, rug, console, etc. So a lot of pieces will be arriving this week. Next week's video, I'll definitely have way more updates and this apartment will look like someone's actually living in it. Before I do end the video though, I don't want to make this like some sort of official like grand announcement or anything, but if you guys have been around since the podcast, it's semi coming back. So it's not going to be a podcast where I upload it, you know, onto Spotify and Apple Podcasts, but it will live on this YouTube channel kind of like as a series. And I'm going to be co-hosting these episodes with my boyfriend, June. And the reason we came to that decision was because the biggest obstacle for me, at least when I was doing that, was getting a guest every single week. You know, like it, it's kind of hard to find people who are comfortable enough being that vulnerable in front of like an audience. We're still gonna be looking for guests, but at least if we don't find one, that's not gonna be the blocker for not uploading an episode. At least like we'll have each other to talk about it with. As for like the cadence of uploading for that particular series, haven't decided yet. A lot of things are still kind of up in the air, but I just thought I would let you guys know that this is something that we are talking about and we're planning for and you know, thinking about a lot right now. I would like to get your guys' thoughts too. Do you guys think it should still be called On The Floor since it's technically not a podcast anymore? Do you guys like that it's just gonna be on YouTube or do you guys actually prefer podcasts? I know I've given you guys a lot of empty promises when it comes to On The Floor and uh, I'm the worst, <laughs> but yeah. Thank you guys for being truly the best. I think I have the nicest community on here. You guys are really, really, really nice to me and I am very, very grateful. So all right, that's it from me. I will see you guys next week. Bye.